other details tonight about a former Oklahoma Christian University professor who was let go after having a gay guest speaker. You might remember this story because we first told you about it back in March when Michael O'Keefe was initially fired. Well, now he's firing back. News 4's Natalie Clydesdale has details. Natalie? Well, Kevin, O'Keefe and the openly gay guest speaker Scott Hale recently filed this lawsuit, accusing the university of libel and breach of contract. You have a 41-year tenured professor who got fired for bringing in a gay guest speaker. The firing of former professor Michael O'Keefe stunning many across Oklahoma Christian University. Students before and after me who were all just shocked by this. His lawyer, Kevin Jacobs, tells News 4 back in March of 2022, O'Keefe invited Scott Hale, who is openly gay, to talk to his business of branding yourself class about resiliency. He, he told that story about just his own personal journey and really connected with uh, the kids. Not, not an advocacy of uh, any type of gay rights. Less than a week later, O'Keefe was fired. Alleged that uh, Professor O'Keefe uh, committed gross misconduct that was contrary to the mission and values of the school. Now both O'Keefe and Hale are firing back with a lawsuit. One of their arguments is that O'Keefe's contract was breached. Uh, after 41 years, not given any opportunity for notice or hearing or trying to figure out what happened. The university did not follow any of their uh, tenure provisions. They're also arguing libel because of an email allegedly sent to OC's faculty and staff by the university's chief legal counsel. Just false misleading. According to the lawsuit, parts of that email claim Hale used inappropriate and graphic language of a sexual nature during his presentation. The email also alleged O'Keefe used intimidation to squelch students reporting or complaining about the content. Well, Oklahoma Christian University leadership told us in a statement today that, quote, OC looks forward to filing its responsive pleading with the court next week. We'll see what happens, Natalie. Thank you.